Here is a wishbone offensive formation. You have three running backs in the backfield, one directly behind the quarterback, flanked by two additional running backs behind them slightly. You're going to have two tight ends on either side of the line outside the offensive tackle. And this is primarily a formation for a run play, although you do have two eligible receivers that you do have the option to attempt a downfield pass to. In fact, this formation is well suited for the option play, which we'll talk about in a later video. But uh, otherwise, all sorts of potential for a run play with three running backs behind the quarterback here. Now let's set up a flexbone uh, formation. Uh, let's see, we'll start by putting both these tight ends back into wing back rather than tight end, and uh, we'll make these guys wideouts. Like so. So a flex foam formation typically has two wide receivers, uh, one running back in the backfield, and two wing backs. Remember the single wing formation from a few videos back? But now there's two of them, and one of them usually goes into motion prior to the snap. Again, this is usually a running play formation, but you do have the option, you have, you know, downfield receivers, you have the option to attempt a downfield pass, and once again, uh, the flexbone formation is, is well suited for the option play. So there you have it, uh, wishbone and flexbone formations. See you again real soon.